Hey everybody, and welcome to my N5 series where I cover a topic in about five minutes. Today we're going to play a little bit of a bass sound and then goof around with the DJ filter so I can explain it a little bit better. Anyway, let's just uh, play something. That should be pretty fine. So I'm pretty sure I've got the DJ filter here. So I'm going to engage it. Yeah, there we go. So effectively the way a DJ filter is usually set up is you've got a, if you go to the left or counterclockwise with the knob, you're going to have a low pass filter. And if you go to the right, it's going to be a high pass filter. So now that we get this engaged, we can adjust it so that we can just basically pass out what we want from the high end, cut that out, or we can open the filter and it, at the uh, noon position, it should be neutral. And then as we go clockwise, you can hear we're cutting out the low end. So this is a pretty powerful filter because it lets you do both a low pass and high pass with the only caveat being that you lose the ability to have a, quite as much control over it. But I mean, this is pretty smooth. And you can hear, you can get pretty dark. You might need headphones to hear this. So anyway, Another little fancy nice mod on here is this DJ filter. Definitely a lot of ways to use it creatively, especially if you want to go and gauge the ability to pitch shift. Get really low. And then further kind of cut off with the high end here. So depends on what you're looking to do, but I think it's great. Nice little uh, digital filter. Anyway, guys, thanks for stopping by. Keep making music. Keep having fun. Remember, if it sounds good, it is good. And peace.